Echocardiography is ultrasound imaging of the heart which is now widely available. There are small handheld devices the size of a mobile phone and there are laptop sized devices which you can carry in your hand as well as devices which you can wheel on a trolley. The echocardiographs in echocardiography laboratories, core laboratories are much larger. It's the size of an Elmera and uh, they have all modes, special modes, everything. And uh, echocardiography as you could have understood by this time, there are uh, so many modes. Simple mode is uh, two dimensional real time imaging of heart structures. Then there is color Doppler, pulse Doppler, continuous wave Doppler. Advanced mode of echocardiography are strain rate imaging, strain imaging, then three dimensional, real time three dimensional or four dimensional echocardiography. All these are now available. All modes may not be available in all machines. Smaller machines may have lesser number of modes. And ubiquitousness means that when the patient presents to the emergency department, portable devices are often used, especially in the diagnosis of acute myocardial function and pericardial effusion. In pericardial effusion, it can also guide emergency pericardial aspiration. In the coronary care unit, it is widely used. It is routine part of uh, even medical rounds in the coronary care unit in addition to clinical evaluation. In the operating rooms, also echocardiography is widely used. Then there is a transthoracic echocardiography as well as transesophageal echocardiography. Transesophageal echocardiography is often used in theatres and there is a special role for advanced surgeries like liver transplantation where it is used for monitoring of left ventricular function and uh, wall motion abnormalities during prolonged surgeries. During surgery for congenital heart disease and other wall heart disease, it is easy to assess the success of repair using transesophageal echocardiography. And now anesthesiologists are well trained in transesophageal echocardiography because they need it in the operating room. So echocardiography is no longer with the cardiologist alone, it is used by technicians, uh, then uh, emergency care persons, intensive care persons, everyone uses echocardiography for one or 